Circuit Playground is our new all-in-one board aimed towards education and beginners. It features 10 NeoPixel LEDs, a motion sensor, a temperature sensor, mini speaker, sound sensor, a light sensor, two buttons, and a switch. We think it's a great way to practice programming on real hardware with no soldering or sewing required. The onboard Atmega 32U4 processor is Arduino compatible, so you can program it with the Arduino IDE and upload your code via micro USB. It also has a JST connector, so you can plug in a battery to make your projects portable. To make it a wearable, we designed and 3D printed a simple bumper and a two-piece strap so we can wear it on our wrist. NinjaFlex filament is really flexible material and it's perfect for strong and super flexible projects. The straps are inserted into slots on the bumper and each strap has an extended end to act as a stopper. One strap has holes for different size wrists and the other one has a little nub so we can snap the two together. A small LiPo battery can be tucked away in between the straps or underneath the board. We designed the parts in Autodesk Fusion 360 with user parameters, so anybody can easily change the length or width of the straps. The Pokemon Go project by Richard Albrighton turned Circuit Playground into a team badge. NeoPixels light up and the motion sensor detects movement and flashes them white. You can also cycle through team colors using the onboard button. There's tons of other projects you can make with Circuit Playground and we have a playlist full of project ideas and tutorials. So be sure to check them out and subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.